and uh, that person is said, oh, tell ya, come up here, I wanna fuck you, I wanna fuck you, I wanna fuck you, I wanna fuck you. <laughs> I can't say this word, right? <laughs> My name is Teya Sutira. I've been a tour guide in Bangkok for over 22 years. I never could have imagined I would see Bangkok like this. I don't think anyone could have. Sanae Kung Teb, I've never been here before. Teya has been here for more than 30 years. But she still has new things to learn. It's the most beautiful place in Bangkok. Today, I want to show you what Bangkok is like during COVID-19 share some personal stories and hopefully give insight about this amazing city. Right now we are going to the Grand Palace and the Emerald Buddha Temple and uh, this place is the most requested from the tourists. But you know what? Every time when I hear from the tourists, I feel like, oh shit, it's so hot. But you know, since the COVID-19, I've never been back here. I've never been back here and I really miss it so much. I'm kind of curious because I heard that it's already open. So I want to see how it looks like. Last time I came here, it was in March 2020. And uh, I never thought that it would go into be my last time working <laughs> as a tour guide. COVID-19 gave me just a hard time. It's just because of no tourists coming here. And my job as a tourist guide if you don't have work, you don't have money. I must appreciate it with this time that I have. Especially the most important one is I have time to spend with my parents. They're getting old, so I feel like thank you so much for giving me this opportunity to be with my parents. And of course, you know, COVID-19 is going to be better, I believe. And once when the tourists come here, of course, they shouldn't miss this place, the Grand Palace and the Emerald Buddha Temple. But Ask themselves what they like. They probably like to eat. Lots of people are crazy, but you know, since I starting to be a tour guide, I was upset, but now I'm okay. I'm just starting to get used to. Some of them ask me to just go to sleep with them every day. And my friends say, hey, Mr. asks you to call, so, you know, I was a, a guide and uh, I stay at the hotel lobby and then uh, I call, hello sir and uh, that person is said, oh, tell ya, come up here, I wanna fuck you, I wanna fuck you, I wanna fuck you, I wanna fuck you <laughs> I can't say this word, right? <laughs> Sorry, that's kind of creepy <laughs> One married couple, they offer me money to have sex with their 13 years old virgin son. Oh my god, but that's enough. <laughs> right now we are in Chatuchak Weekend Market, but you can have a look today how bad it looks. When I did a tour around here, it was packed of people. <sighs> I never could imagine that um, I could see that market is closing. It's very sad. but. Just like the Grand Palace and the Emerald Buddha is reopening, I feel like we are having hope. And I believe that Bangkok is strong and we can make it. We'll be okay. And watch that